Look at that huge gouge in there, guys. A huge chip on the side, and I already started attaching all of the side coverings. As you can see, it says I received my one wheel GT today with a pretty serious chip. I have this in the previous video talking about the chip in the side. Um, it lo did look like it was touched up with paint as well. You guys could see the picture. Um, but I'm, I asked for like a discount or some money back regarding the chip. Uh, and I did mention before that they were willing to give me $35. So here's that email. This is Future Motion's response. They said, I'm sorry to hear that your board came this way. And I can assure you that if any damage uh, was noticed by our team, we definitely would not try to cover it up and pass it off on you. We are committed to building high quality products. But now this is where it gets interesting. It says, that being said, your board will get quite a few scuffs, scrapes, and gashes just from normal riding. Our product is not meant to always look pretty, but it is durable and will always allow you to continue having fun with all the scrapes. So, and they said as a one-time courtesy that they're going to refund me the cost of the rail guards. But, you know, my point to me is, you know, why even sell rail guards? Per One Wheel's website, it says that rail guards are there to protect your board and customize your look. And it also says that the adhesive back plastic provides defense against scratches and scrapes to keep your board looking fresh. You know, the, the chip is in the factory paint. He said, also, I can confirm um, that you do have the updated foot pads already. So uh, we're going to be taking a look at that. But I was kind of pissed, right? So here's my response back to them. I said... Um, hello, Mark. Thank you for the response. To be clear, the damage is done to the actual rails, not the rail guards. I purchased the rail guard so I could prevent the actual rail from getting damaged and it's damaged. The rail clearly has a chip out of the factory paint, which hurts its resale value beyond the cost of the rail guards. The commitment to high quality products is not being met here. I understand with use, boards get messed up, but nothing was used yet. It came out of the box this way and the damage is in an area that would be protected with proper care or the rail guards. Not trying to be a pain. I do apologize. I'm really hoping more could be refunded than just the cost of the rail guards. And I said I spent over two thousand dollars. It's just upsetting. Um, so uh, I think I don't know if I sent another email or they actually responded back to me here. Oh, here's he he responds back and he says, uh, "Hey Matthew, I do apologize for the damage to the rail." We have extensive quality control checks, and I can assure you that the board did not leave our facility in this condition. We have seen damage caused during transit on occasion, which is likely the cause here. We can provide two solutions. The first being we could generate a label for you to return the board to us, and once in our facility, we would reship a brand new board out to you. The second solution is to refund the cost of the rail guards back to your original uh, payment methods. Please let me know. Uh, how you would like to proceed. I'm sorry for any inconvenience. Looking forward to a resolution. So I was like, dang, dude, I kind of still a little bit bummed out about that, right? Hey, Mark, the chip is worth more than 35 rail guards to me, so I'd like to send it back. I was hoping for a $300 refund or gift card. I'm assuming Future Motion will not be charging shipping costs or restocking fees to to the shipping damage and major inconvenience. I didn't notice the chip until I started sticking on the rail guards before any use. I have the unboxing video and I can provide it if needed. Should I remove the rail guards before returning? They were shipped in a separate box. Thank you for taking care of this promptly. So here I am thinking I'm about to return it, right? Well, check this out. I get an email that a portion was refunded and I was like, what is going on, right? And then I get an email from this Yvonne lady, and here, I'll show you it. She says, hey, Matthew, I'm Yvonne. I'm a customer support manager here at Future Motion. I've been reviewing your case. Very sorry that there is a blemish on your rail of the board. This can happen when the board is in transit. I'm not able to exchange the board now that the rail guards are installed on the board. All exchange needs to meet a return policy, which is unused in the original condition it was received. However, I am able to offer a refund on your order of $75 as a very sorry for your experience with how you received the board. I am able to provide a refund for the rail guards as promised and an additional $75 refund. You will see this in a separate email noting the refund. Uh, the refund will be available in form on the original payment, blah, 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 blah. 
So pretty much, long story short, the rail guards are $35. They're giving me a $75 refund. I'm getting basically $110 back from Future Motion and One Wheel because of that chip. Um, you know, I'm not happy with it. Like I said in my email, I was like expecting at least like 300 bucks. So I don't know if I should just bite the bullet, keep it. I mean, to ship it back. And she even said, now that I installed the rail guards, I didn't notice the chip until I started putting on the rail guards. So it's just, no, I don't even think I can return it. It's unbelievable. But I'm not going to let this bum me out, man. I saw this. I see one wheel of the tournaments and the racing and everything. So my next video, you're going to see me trying a one wheel for the very first time. I hope you found this uh, future this video informative. You know, if, if you get a damaged product from One Wheel, talk to them and tell them about it. Maybe they could do something for you. Got $110 off because of that blemish. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe, like the video. Check you guys soon. Peace. The board, actually. I, I didn't follow the board. I actually whiplash my leg.